morning. It's really exciting to be here at Apple Park Complex, the sprawling 175 acre headquarters here in Cupertino. And we are standing right in front of the Steve Jobs Theater. This campus was, was built on his vision. And yesterday, camp, uh, Apple used this campus to announce what they call setting the stage for the next decade of technology. It is the biggest leap forward since the original iPhone. After months of anticipation and speculation, Apple finally unveiling its latest and greatest. iPhone 10, this really is the future. The next generation of the phone that changed the way we do just about everything. Powerful and pricey at 1,000 bucks, the company's crown jewel is all glass, edge to edge. The home button gone. Instead of a thumbprint, the phone unlocks with a simple glance. We call this Face ID. A revolutionary technology that's supposed to be more secure than Touch ID. Let's try that again. Ho, ho, ho. When it let's, works. Let's uh, go to back up here. But that isn't discouraging faithful fans. I'm excited. I can't wait to buy it. Among the new specs, a brighter OLED display, wireless charging, and animated emojis that follow your face. It's light, it's sleek, but it's also more fun. The iPhone 10 takes emojis to a whole new level. The Animoji captures your facial expression. For those looking to burn a smaller hole in their wallet, the 8 and 8 Plus are also on the way. Also new, an Apple Watch with its own cell connection. No more need to have a phone in tow. But for some Apple fans, the biggest highlight wasn't something they could buy. The company's new headquarters, rumored to have cost $5 billion, finally revealed. This is our first ever look at Apple's incredible new campus. Envisioned by Steve Jobs to fit seamlessly with nature, it sprawls across 175 acres and is completely powered by renewable energy. A space that honors the company's innovative founder six years after his death. Steve's vision and passion live on here at Apple Park and everywhere in Apple. Today and always, we honor him. And guys, that $1,000 price tag may, may sound outrageous, but experts said that this is where technology is simply heading. And a lot of the fans that we've spoken to say they don't mind paying that much money if it means getting all those incredible bells and whistles. <laughs> guys? All right, Lucy, thank you very much. You like those bells and whistles? Yeah, yeah. I like them. Yeah? Paul always more. gets the new, the new <laughs> fabulous <laughs> toy. <laughs> Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.